once there was a ball of yarn. It was soft, beautiful, and felt warm to the touch. It wasn't like other yarns. In fact, it was so soft that it was difficult to knit. And because of this fact, was not the first yarn to be chosen. It sat by itself for a very long time, waiting for its turn to be useful. One day, it was donated to a church where it found a new home. There were other balls of yarn welcoming it, and it seemed like it had finally found its place. One day, a hand picked it up and began knitting. The ball of yarn had no idea what it was going to be, but it trusted the hand to make it into something useful. Week after week, it met with the hand, and as it did, it heard voices of joy and laughter. Lots of talking, and even sometimes a tear or two would fall upon its surface. Mostly the yarn felt something special, a presence of holiness, of love and caring. These days were fruitful, and the yarn began to grow. Then it was placed in a box and put on a shelf. It was dark and quiet there, and although the yarn heard the voices, they were only faint and muffled. One day, the yarn felt the box being lifted off the shelf and moving around. For a day and a night, it was bumped and bounced and heard many strange noises, like rumbling tires and rushing wind, until finally it came to rest. It heard the paper on the outside of the box tearing, and then there was sunlight. Two smiling faces were looking at it, and it was lifted out of the box, examined and cuddled. One of the faces began explaining its usefulness to the gentle woman beside him. Soon she seemed to understand and allowed him to wrap her in the softness of the beautiful shawl that it had grown to be. This became a tradition at prayer time, in the evening, or any time the woman needed comfort of warmth and softness from the shawl. She would often wear it when she took a nap on the chair or the couch. It became a way of sharing for the man who offered it to the woman. He felt the softness and learned to love it because it was a part of their time together. One day, the woman grew very quiet and the shawl was there to keep her company. Soon she lay very still and cold. The shawl was confused, but it knew its function. It wrapped itself around her, gripping her tightly in the soft fibers. The shawl traveled with the woman on her journey to an unknown place. It knew she needed it to keep her warm. Wherever she was going, it cloaked her with all the softness and gentleness that it could find. And it is still with her today, gifting her with the presence of holiness, love, and caring that was knitted into it at the very beginning. Mm -hmm.